during this age of 12 to 25 is when most mental disorders appear, whether they are severe or moderate or mild, it all happens during that age period. There's so many people that are needing the services, that are unsatisfied by the services, and the numbers just keep going up. That in itself, for me, is it just, it just shows that it needs an overhaul. I can say this from the perspective of having been a clinician and the coordinator of a program and a researcher in the field, but it wouldn't do justice to all the stories and accounts we've heard over the last year and a half. When the Access and the TRAM initiative came forward, it was like a sign that said, somebody has it together and they know that things need to be changed in this country. We wanted a team that would be most likely to fulfill the mandate um, to do the transformative research that will be necessary uh, to change the system. For me, the transformation started when this process started. I'm just looking forward to seeing the rest of it unfold. We all came into the process with our own identities and our background. So I came in as a clinician, as a researcher, someone came in as a family member. We're on the verge of something truly innovative and transformational to reach out to our youth and to help them in the best way possible. They have to get what they need right away. So we have set ourselves a target of 72 hours. Within 72 hours, people will get seen. I love that it was a completely new way of looking at things that hadn't been done before. And even the little tiniest things that we proposed that we really liked, they really found a way to, to incorporate it. They really took what we said and they listened.